Hey guys, it's Angela and for today's video I am going to be showing you guys why I am returning my Helix mattress after careful deliberation that was a decision that I had to make so I hope that you like this video it is a very honest and upfront type of decision that I had to make and I gave you guys as much information as I could uh, during the process, oops, sorry, during the process of recording this video. So I hope that you guys enjoy. Okay guys, so as you can see on this video, I am doing a second thoughts on my Helix mattress. Right there you can see there is an imprint on the mattress because that is where I sleep. The rest of the mattress is still flawless, but there is a clear imprint in the buckling of the fabric. and. Honestly, I feel like the foam underneath is starting to wear down. I feel like when you sit in this side of the bed, it feels different than if you sit on this side of the bed. So, I mean, even the handprint difference, like, there's that side. Let me come over here. So there is a noticeable difference in the mattress already and it's only been about 45 days since I got this mattress so I called the company and initially I just thought that I got the mattress too soft so probably around day 32 I called Helix and I told them you know I think I ordered the mattress too soft um, and um, it's not very comfortable anymore I'm starting to get back pain again. So they told me I, I wanted to exchange it for a mattress with a firmer top. And they said that they didn't process exchanges, they would only process a return. But they did send me this, and I apologize for the lighting in here, I know it's kind of dark. Um, this is a foam topper, it is a two inch foam topper. I haven't unboxed it yet because I wanted to make sure I recorded it. And um, this is a two inch foam topper and it's supposed to help the mattress feel firmer. Now I'm very skeptical about foam toppers because I feel like they don't stay in place. They start to buckle and start doing this type of thing um, in a sooner scale. So. I decided to go ahead and give it one last shot with the foam topper. I'm probably going to try it for about a week. And if I am not sleeping any better, I'm going to return my Helix mattress. So um, if you have any recommendations of other online foam mattresses that are of better quality or last longer, let me know in the comments below. I'm going to start doing some more research because I thought I made the best choice and honestly it is still more comfortable than my old mattress, so I have to say that, but I don't like how quickly it's beginning to deteriorate. So I'm going to go ahead and put the foam topper on and I will be right back with you guys.
Okay, guys. So there is the mattress topper. It is on the bed. It was a lot easier to take out of the box than the mattress was. Is that it is not as vacuum sealed. And the plastic wrap is very, very slippery. As you can see, I'm winded, completely out of breath. But I'm going to go ahead and put my bed sheets back on and see how this topper helps with my um, sleep quality. Um, it doesn't look bad. It's, you know, it's two inch, two inch pad. It's okay. It's wrapped in that fabric that they put on the other one. But I'm glad it's the same fabric because, as the mattress, I mean, because I'll be able to tell if it's doing anything, if it's starting to break down or sink in or anything like that. So, alright guys, I'm going to say goodnight for now and I will check back with you guys in a couple days. This will probably be about a week's worth of clips to determine whether or not I return the mattress altogether. So, have a good night, and I will see you guys in the morning. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, guys, so as you can see, the kids are playing with a very large box, and that is because I have decided, after much deliberation, to return my Helix mattress. <laughs> Now I have been, it's been about probably 10 days since the last clip that you saw of the mattress pad and um, yeah, I had to make the very difficult decision to return it. It's not that it is a bad product because by all means it is not a bad mattress. I just, I feel like I did not get the right firmness and um, Helix doesn't really have a great exchange policy in place. Like in order for me to get a different firm, firm a mattress with a different firmness, I would have to return the Helix, order a new Helix, like process the refund, order a new Helix, and then um, wait for shipping on that one, which would leave me about two weeks without a mattress. So I kept doing some research, and I decided to get the Dynasty memory, uh, the memory foam mattress on Amazon. It is a lot less expensive, it is a higher firmness, and it is supposed to be a cooling mattress, so hopefully I won't have overheating issues at night, but that is what is inside this very large box. The box weighs approximately 86 pounds, which is the equivalent to that child sitting on the box, minus three pounds. Michaela weighs 89 pounds, so. Yeah, it's only three, like, I don't know if it was being like close, I think I'm like 87 Yeah, something like that. like a pound or two. Yeah. So right now they're just playing on the box. Um, I will not be putting the mattress, pardon my room, it's a bit of a mess right now. I have to clean it up today. I will not be putting the mattress on here on this bed because um, my parents are going to be moving into my house and um, I'm going to give them the master bedroom. But since um, the mattress is extremely heavy to open, I'm going to go ahead and put the mattress in the room where I'm gonna be moving to so I'm gonna go show you guys that now okay so this is the room where I will be moving into temporarily and this is just for a few months while we find and purchase a home um, in the fall so it is much smaller than my master of course and it does have access to the bathroom through that door but I will not be using that master bathroom because that is um, going to be for my parents but basically this was Kylie's nursery so I'm gonna be opening and expanding the mattress here in just a little bit I'm waiting for the floor to dry because I just mopped and swept and got the room ready um, I'm gonna be leaving the plastic underneath the mattress so that it does not get dirty on the floor until I can get the um, base and frame from my parents bed so basically they're gonna move their frame and base in here with my mattress for me and they're gonna keep my base for their mattress over there until we move. So just because my bed is so large, I don't think it will fit in here with the headboard and nightstand and all that. So we're gonna do it that way. It'll be easier, less stuff to move too, so. Okay guys, so like I said, it took 
a long time to choose to purchase this mattress, the Helix mattress, and it took not quite as long, but still a long time to decide to return it. Um, it is a great quality mattress. It is comfortable. I just got the wrong firmness. I got it too soft, and as I sleep on it more and more, it gets softer as it accommodates to my body, which is what a memory mattress is supposed to do. But it's just to the point where it is too soft. I feel like my entire bottom half of my body is sinking down throughout the night. And then, um, not that it's hard to get out of in the mornings, but I just wake up with back pain. So um, if Helix had some sort of policy in place where you could do a mattress exchange, perhaps that would be that would have been an option for me at this time. But um, honestly, I just <laughs> we have a video bomber back there. Um, I just decided to you know what just return it before the hundred day trial expires, and then I'm stuck with it, and it doesn't get any better. So. Um, I did give their mattress topper a shot, as you guys saw, but it just wasn't going to work out. So I guess I will leave you guys with that. I am going to show you a clip of unboxing and um, airing out my um, Dynasty mattress. And I will do a review on that mattress on my next video. I also wanted to add, guys, that the customer service at Helix has been nothing but wonderful. What is my hair doing? They have been nothing but wonderful. They stay in constant contact, letting me know who the uh, donation um, provider, or not the provider, but the place that I'm donating the mattress to is, and gave me their contact information. Um, and they have been nothing but wonderful at ex explaining the process of the return. So basically, um, I notified them once the pickup was scheduled. It is scheduled for tomorrow at 10 a.m. And um, for you guys, it might be today. But um, I won't be home, so my dad will be here uh, when the thrift store comes to pick up the mattress. And um, once it gets picked up, they are notified, and um, then they will process the refund for the full amount of the mattress, which will be processed in five to seven business days. So um, overall, it's a very easy, hassle-free process. Um, they were very understanding, and you know, they even said, you know, sorry, our mattress wasn't the right fit for you, but hopefully, it will go to somebody who will be able to enjoy it. So that made me feel a lot better about the whole. Um, decision to return the mattress so I just wanted to add that little bit so um, yeah that's basically um, that's basically it so I'm gonna leave this video for now and I will see you guys very soon also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and don't forget to follow me on Instagram um, I am Angela that babe on Instagram and I am YouTube that babe on Twitter and snapchat um, I have a lot of videos coming up guys. I have to do the Dynasty unboxing. I have to do my Dollar Tree haul, the nail video that I'm still waiting to do, but these nails are just such a mess right now. Um, I also have my Influencer box box. I got, I got my very first box box in the mail this week. So I will be recording that as well this weekend. I have not opened it yet. I am just holding out, waiting until I get a chance to record it. And I will be reviewing all the products inside. So I hope you guys will stick around and join me for those videos. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.